Hello, good morning students. I hope you're doing well. This is Mr. Shahab. I will show you today how to use your class key. Now, in when you are in grade five and above, a lot of your assignments are going to be given inside an app called Class Kick. <coughs> Sorry for that. So always make sure that you have the Class Kick app inside your iPad. If you don't have this app, you can go to the App Store. You can go to App Store. All right, and you can search for Class Kick, and you can download this app. All right, this is the app. This is the green color app. You have to download this app. Okay, so um, once you have downloaded the app, okay, I don't need to update it, but once you have downloaded the app, you should see the app on your screen. You can open the app, all right, and you can go on and log in. All right, by this time, Miss your teacher or Mr. Samit should give you your username and password. If you don't have these, please get to Mr. Samit or Ms. Hanan and check and ask them for your username and password. Now I will use one of the students' username, all right? And I'm gonna put the password, just a simple password for now. I'll change the password again later on. And once you click on login, this is the screen that you see as assignment okay so you can click on profile over here and you can change your password over here if you want to change this is up to you and you can go to assignments and you can look that these are your teachers right now who is giving you assignments all right now i can see uh, mr smith which is mr reese smith is teaching you guys social studies you can see his last name is over here mr smith so you can check over here. Let's say Mr. Smith's class is opening up. You click on the class of Mr. Smith. And let's say this is the grade five, social studies week one. I'm gonna click over here, all right? And then this is my class kick. So now you're gonna follow Mr. Smith in the class. And if he tells you to go to page number two, you're gonna go over here and he's gonna ask you to answer, all right? If you want to answer, you can click on this tool on the top. Uh, three okay click on this point all right and you can answer here uh, something what are geographic tools they are important tools for mapping I believe I'm not sure I actually, actually not really good at this all right so let's say this is my answer okay you also can go on and you can also draw using the draw button. So there's an option called draw over here. You click on the draw. You can choose, click again, choose the size, choose the color. You can write, draw, let's say, a tool. Let's say I want to draw a scale, okay? Okay, and you can draw a scale over here. Okay, and you can even highlight this let's say with this color this can be a highlighter or a coloring thing up to you and then you can also put like a text box over here if you click on the text box on your top um, side that says T click on that and this is the text box one second yeah, let's bring this up over here so let's start over here this is a ruler to this could be a ruler okay and um you can also make lines over here if you want there's a line button over here beside that you can make it lower or bigger change the color up to you guys okay you also have the option of taking adding screenshots so for example i can click on this camera button i can choose from photos and then i can let's say take a picture let's say take a picture okay. let's say just for the sake of saying it, i can just quickly crop it 
and click on done. I can put this over here, okay? And um, I can also record over here. There's a recording button. You can, you can click this on, you can record. Hello, 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 hello. There's a recorder over here. You can also um, rub things. So for example, if I wrote something over here, you can rub it off in this button, okay? And um, you can also, let's say, remove this. You hold this, you can select a tool, hold this and then go and delete this over here if you want to, all right? Once you are done with your work and you want Mr. this teacher to check your work, you can go over here, one second. Let's put this over here. You can go on your top right, there's a hand over here, click on the hand. You can please check, all right? So DJ will know that he should come and check your work. That's pretty much the most important thing about class kick. So let me repeat once again. If you want to uh, undo, redo, undo, redo, undo, redo, undo, redo, first two um, cursors, then we have got the select option. So if you want to select something, then we have got the scroll tool to go up and down. Then you've got the, the, the pen tool, you can do anything, you can draw a smiley face, hi, hello. Then you have the highlighter tool, you can highlight everything over here. Then you've got the rubber, you can rub all of them. Okay, text box, you can write something. All right line to make line then we have the recorder this is to add a link you want to add a link over here from websites and then you can add pictures over here to your thing so all of these are ways to make your assignment look really nice you should always ask the teacher what does he want from you in terms of answers all right oh don't forget the hand on the top you can ask please uh, come please come and check my work you'll come and check it. All right. Thank you and have a good day. Bye-bye.